Hey guys, what's up? Queenie K here. Welcome back to my channel. So I'm just going to show you guys how I get my, well, currently really unkept wash and go um, into a really slick middle part ponytail. So as you can see, my hair is very just like dense right now. So it's hard to get it flat, but we're going to do it. And I'm going to show you guys how I do that and make sure like you don't want one of these. Like, you know those? Those ponytails where the sides are just so big and you turn to the side and your head just looks so long. We're not going to do that. So we're going to get it flat, 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 flat. Even though it's kind of dense and, ooh, you know. So let's do that. I'm going to use a spray bottle of water. Again, my hair does have some gel in it, so it will be a little bit easier, but I'm just gonna show you guys a technique in which I achieve the look. So if your hair is completely clean and completely dry, all of the same steps and it will work, I promise. Okay, so because we wanna make sure everything's gonna be on flat, flat, like Drake said, except we're talking about hair, um, I'm gonna part my hair right here and I'm going to slick by layer because this ain't a game. We are slicking by layer because it all needs to be flat. So use as much Eco Styler as you need to smoothen out these roots here. So I'm gonna dab it in. And brush it down to the point where it like, like you feel it seeping through, okay? okay? So we're gonna use a brush and brush it through. Okay, so now, as you can see, this part's super flat. I'm gonna keep continuing, try to reach the back of my head. Like, all of this. So we don't have a big head in the back. And then I'm gonna use a brush to flatten it again. So now I'm gonna come around to this side and make a part like I did on the other side. So now the back is obviously a bit flatter. This part's already starting to come back up, so we gotta move quick and, um, I'm going to split this again. And then I'm going to continue to the top piece. Okay, so this part is somewhat done. So I'm just gonna clip it. You don't need to do this part, but I'm just gonna do it for the sake of this video. Um, and then I'm gonna do the same thing to this side. Okay, so this is quite the difference from the beginning. As you can see, it's easily pulled back. And as you can see, the back of my head is not sticking up. It is as flat as it can be. And then I'm getting most of my hair into my puff. So all my hair isn't up here, here, and here. It is flat and I'm getting the most out of my puff. maximizing the puff okay okay so after smoothening it down with my hands I'm just gonna go ahead and tie it with a rubber um, a hair elastic okay we did it my arms are tired <laughs> okay so now that my hair is in an actual ponytail I'm gonna use my brush and just smoothen it out all the layer of gel is holding it in place, so this is good. Okay, so now I'm going to start pinning any pieces I feel like need to be tighter. Even though because of how I tied it and how I slicked it, everything is pretty secure. So this also minimizes the amount of pins you need. I feel like it looks better when you have less bobby pins sticking in your hair. And then I'm gonna use eco style on my edges so I can style them a little bit so I'm just using a little toothbrush with some eco styler and styling my edges Okay, so as you can see, as it's drying, the flaking from like all the product buildup and like the mixing of products is disappearing. So 
Don't worry, I'm not gonna go outside looking like I have flakes of dandruff everywhere. Okay, so now that my hair is in a ponytail, slicked, edges are done, I'm gonna go ahead and pick out my pump. Okay, so I think this is it for this um, video. This is the method that I use when I need my hair to be super slick on the sides and especially here. You guys know what I mean when I say here is looking super big, like right here on some people when they don't slick it down properly. So this is what I do to get it super flat. I take my time and I go in layers and I use Eco Styler to brush it through my entire head. So it's not just the top and it's not just the sides. You go through your hair and you slick it down, brush it, take your time, and you can get a really slick ponytail. So even if you do have really tight curls, I promise you it's possible if you take your time, detangle if you need to, um, use water, Eco Styler, any sort of edge controller gel that you feel like works for your hair and you're good and obviously if that is not enough for you at the end of it all you can also use a scarf to flatten it even more the thing about the scarf is it's hard to get this middle part so really focus on this part here so then when it comes to the scarf it can really kind of lay down the sides for you but um i personally do don't need to use a scarf all the time because if i do it well enough then i'm good to go so hopefully this helped you guys and if you have been trying to achieve a really really flat style slick style like this one that you can use this these same steps and achieve it it's super easy and um i know it's basic but sometimes it's hard to get the easy things down you know so thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed it and yeah i'll see you guys later bye